A friend recently asked me, how do you use Jing to capture presentations that you create in PowerPoint? Now, one reason people often do this is because they don't want to pay all the money for um, Camtasia. And so this is a cheaper way to do it. This is my, my own approach. Um, I've installed Jing, and I have a PowerPoint presentation open. And I'm going to show you how you do that. So at the top of the page here, here's the little icon for Jing. And there's a little plus sign. I'm going to click on that. It says Capture. When I do that, it puts these little lines all over the page. I'm going to go up to the upper left-hand corner of my PowerPoint, and I'm going to pull it across to the bottom portion. Now that I've done that, these little icons are available at the bottom. So I'm going to click on Capture Video. I click that, and if I have a microphone on, it tells me that the microphone's on. It goes 3, 2, 1, and it starts capturing. Now from here, I can put my headset on, and I can talk, just like I'm talking now, and uh, talk through my video. And then over here, off the side, outside of the, those, these little uh, dotted lines, I can click on these to change the slide that's up in the PowerPoint. So I'll click on, so this says, how to make a hot dog, and I click the next thing, bink. Get the bun, get the hot dog. Put them together and add the toppings. Enjoy. OK, now I've finished that. I'm going to hit Stop. And now I can, uh, I can save or I can upload my video to somewhere. Um, I'm just going to play this back right now so you can see what happens. So I hit Play. And here in this window, it, uh, it's going to go through the presentation that I just created that's in a file format that I can now distribute and upload to file sites such as YouTube. That is assuming that you paid for the upgrade to Jing that right now is about $14.99 a year. Um, okay, the screen hasn't changed yet, but it will any second now. You see the, the little bar going across the bottom. Okay, this is where I started changing slides. And that's it. Now, now I have um, a file that I, that's a video that I can distribute.